Wow, this is heavy, you guys. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh, what in the... No! Dude! What is going on today, guys? It is a little bit after 8 p.m. and we're gonna be trying something that I've never tried before. We're gonna be doing some magnet fishing at night out on the boat. I bought a great big 30,000 lumen work light. I also have my headlamp light and we're gonna see how well lit up we can get this boat. I have no idea if this is gonna work at all, you guys. We might not be able to see it all once we get out there. But I'm gonna give it a shot and we're gonna see if it works. Now we did just get 17 inches of snow today and I just had to spend 30 minutes shoveling out this entire boat ramp. So we're gonna put this boat in the river, you guys. We're gonna head out there and we're gonna see if we can find anything tonight. If you guys would like to pick up some merch or you want to pick up a magnet the links will be down in the description guys let's see what time we got right now 8 1 p.m i brought my boat all the way out here to try and do some night magnet fishing and i can't even put the boat in unless i shovel out the entire way so before we even try to back the boat in you guys we gotta shovel us a massive path into the water You guys, boom, check this out. This is my brand new purchase here for night fishing. We're gonna see how this works. I got the Power Smith. This is a 30,000 lumen work light. We're gonna stick this thing right in the back of the boat and I think it stands up pretty tall. So I'm thinking if I stand this thing up in the back of the boat and point the light down towards me, we should have quite a bit of light in there, you guys. All right, guys, I got the boat ramp shoveled out. I got our big old 30,000 lumen work light set up. We're gonna go ahead and see if we can put this boat in the water and hopefully we don't slide into the water. <laughs> All right, guys, let's plug these bad boys in. 30,000 lumen work light, man. We're gonna see how bright these bad boys are. Oh, oh, dude, now we're talking, buddy. Hold on a second. And wait, I think I can raise these up too. Hold on. Oh yeah, dude, you gotta be kidding me. Dude, now this is crazy, you guys. Look at this entire boat is lit right up, man. Looks like it's the middle of the day. I need sunglasses. I'm gonna get this boat fired up here and uh, we're gonna buzz down the river, you guys. We're gonna find us a spot to magnet fish. While we wait for that to warm up, I can't forget, I have to put these lights on here. These are actually like, these are the lights that you legally have to have on for boating at night. Uh, well, I got this thing uh, plugged in here, but it doesn't look like it's lighting up. I don't like that, you guys. Am I supposed to flip a switch or something? Navigation, is that what that's for? Oh, yes, buddy, we got light. Heck yeah, you guys. So the back light's working, now I just gotta hook up the front light. Um, not good, you guys. This light is not working, man. I just shoveled out an entire boat ramp, loaded my boat in the river. I don't think I can go without this. I have to have this. This is like necessary, It's you have to. All right, guys, check it out. I just ran to Walmart, and what time is it now? We got 10.49. I had to run to Walmart, and I don't have time to rewire a whole one of these lights. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna duct tape this thing to the battery, and I'm just gonna kinda put the wires on here. Boom. And just like so, now we have a front light. <laughs> it's not a very permanent setup, but it's definitely gonna work for tonight. I'm gonna untie us here and we're gonna head down the river, see if we can find us a spot to go magnet fishing. Hopefully we don't have no more floating iceberg chunks coming down the river, cause I'm sure those would be like impossible to see in the dark. Slow, no wake through the bridges. Check it out, you guys. This bridge has got tons of cool lights on it. Oh, hello. 
I just stuck something really hard. What is this one, you guys? Uh, what do we got here? Holy big old bolt. My goodness. Look at that thing. That is the last thing I was expecting to pull up, dude. That thing stuck so hard. You could probably hear it click. It was so hard. Oh, I think I got something, you guys. Oh, oh yes, yeah, sir. What do we got? A little bit of weight on there. Ooh, look at that, man. It almost looks like some kind of pulley to me. Yeah, like maybe a rope or a chain or something might have ran on there. Who knows? All right, you guys, check that one out. We got us the old pulley piece. Now, I want to show you something quick here. We got to take the trolling motor over to the shore. I don't know if something used to go on in this area back in the day, but check this out. Can you guys see like that wood? There's wood, and it almost looks like maybe there used to be a building Back in the day here, I have no idea, man. That's kind of what it looks like to me. See that wood? Yep, and look at big old bolt. Another big old bolt sticking out of the, the side there. There was definitely some kind of building in this area back in the day, I think. So really, there's no telling what this thing came off of, what it was used for, and who knows what else is in here. Something on there. Definitely something on there. Oh my goodness, what the heck do we got here? Oh, uh, yeah, whoa. Look at, dude, I caught a leg. Ha <laughs> ha you guys. What? Oh, we almost sent that one back in the water. Look at, what the heck, man? That thing definitely came off of like some kind of action figure or something what on earth you guys now that is a funky find we caught us a leg dude and attached to it we got us a big old bolt probably something like one of those bolts i just showed you guys sticking out of that wood over there all right oh something here guys Again, very next throw right after we caught the leg, I got something again. What do we got this time? The action figure himself? Probably not. Ooh. Whoa, buddy. Hold on a second, you guys. Whoa, dude. What the heck is this? Look at this thing. That is crazy looking. It's got this loop on here. But that almost looks like a knife, man. Like some kind of shank or something. Holy cow. What the heck do you guys think that one is, man? That one might be worth cleaning up to see what the heck it is. Super cool. Oh, bingo, you guys. Look at what it is. We got us the old cash money railroad spike. Just like I was saying with the horseshoes before, you guys. Seriously, we seem to find these everywhere. And that one is way too rusted on top, of course. You're definitely not going to be able to see the stamp on that one. Oh, man. I just landed right on something, dude. Yep. Oh, what do we got here? I'm kind of pulling myself right to it almost. Oh yeah, buddy. This one's got some decent weight. Oh, come here. Come here. Oh yeah, whoa, that's actually really heavy. Oh, 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 oh. What is this, you guys? Oh my gosh, that's pretty heavy. Come on. Oh, what is this? Oh, what? The heck is that? Um, I have no clue what to think of that one. It almost looks like some kind of piece off of like the A-frame that we found. This one's got a big old slot in it. Just a big old scrap metal looking piece. A little bit of cash. And I seen some color. Definitely no hook left on that bad boy, you guys. We got us the old busted up yellow junk jig.
Oh, there's actually some stuff on here. How did I not feel that? Holy cotton. No, really, dude. Look at, we got us a second railroad spike. But look at you guys. We got another fishing jig in there. Oh, and look at, I didn't even see that right away. We got us the old spinner blade or the spoon. Holy cow, you guys. So we got us a little two for one on the fishing lures. Man, this river is stacked full of all kinds of fishing gear, you guys. Oh, I just stuck something, dude. Heck yeah, man. Now this has got some weight to it. Wow. Wow. Oh, did we just stick something else? Wow, this is heavy, you guys. If this even comes up, holy cow. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh, what in the? No, dude. Oh my gosh, bingo, buddy. You guys, this is absolutely insane. Oh, check that out. There goes the train at night. I'm not even sure if you can see it from here. What time do we got? 1.36, holy cow, buckle. You guys, this is honestly mind blowing. Every single time we come out in the boat without fail now, we find anchors every time. And look at this one, what the heck is that? There's like a bolt going through there. That looks old school, dude. Unbelievable, you guys. Yes, dude. And there was another funky looking piece on here. Look at this little Mickey Mouse looking thing. What the heck is that, man? Some kind of thin plate looking piece with the ears on there. You guys, heck yeah, man. Look at this. We started off pretty slow and next thing you know, we got us a big old anchor in the cart. And there's a lot of super cool stuff we're finding. Heck yeah, you guys. Magna fishing on the boat at night here. This is working pretty slick. Hopefully we're getting good footage here with the lighting and everything. I hope this is turning out good. Um, is there actually something on there? I've been bobbing the magnet up and down for how long now? I didn't even notice there was anything on there. Oh uh, yeah, looks like it anyway. Dude, holy cow. Well, first of all, it looks like we got us a big old bolt or something on there. But look at it. Look at you guys. We got another fishing jig, man. Holy cow. Look at the eyeballs on that sucker. The old googly eyes. That rubber is super beat up. Could probably just rip that sucker right off of there. And boom, man. We got us a brand new jig ready to go fishing. Heck yeah, you guys. This is nuts. Oh, what the? Ow. Hold on a second. There was something. Ow. Pinching my finger. Owie, what is that? Got a piece of metal poking me or something in my glove. Ouch. I just stuck something super hard though, you guys. Oh my gosh. What is that, dude? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, and it's coming up. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, the weight, dude. We sucked it up out of the mud. I can feel it. Oh, what is this? Holy, dude, whoa. You guys, <laughs> look at this one, man. It's like a big old long shaft with some, uh, what you call it's on the end here. Couple holes in there. And I'm pretty sure the other end looks exactly the same. It does, dude. What the heck do you think this one is, you guys? <laughs> Holy cow, you guys, now we are stacking up some serious weight in this cart. What is this? Am I pulling something already? I threw it right next to shore here. <laughs> and look at this, right next to this big old cement pipe. I got something, but hold on, hold on a second. We are gonna crash, crash, crash. There we go. Oh my God. That's kind of heavy, man. Whoa, what in the world, dude? 
You guys, whoa, what the heck is this man? I've never seen anything like this. Hold on, this is a stick, get that out of here. But you guys, what the heck is going on on this magnet right now? Look at all of these. I think these look like individual pieces, honestly. Uh, one, two, uh, three, four, five, and six. You guys, holy smokes, look at these things, man. What do you think these are? One toss, I landed on a big pile of these things. And I bet you there's more of them down there, honestly. Looks like some kind of giant staple or maybe some kind of pin, I don't know. Right next to that little culvert drain over there, we're gonna float back over there and try that again. I don't know what these are. Nah, -uh. <laughs> uh, immediately, yep, some heavy stuff again, dude. Oh, hold on, gotta drive us away from the shore. Right next to the culvert again, I'm telling you, man. I got some big heavy stuff again. What do you think, it's gonna be some more of them staples or something? Dude, it is, Whoa, okay, this is weird. Holy cow, you guys, look it. It looks like what, one, two, three more? Somebody's gotta know what these are or what they're used for. Look at them things. I don't know what to think here, you guys. This is crazy. Oh my gosh, you guys, look it. I just went to throw and I guess I've only been throwing out so much rope every throw and look it. Look at the whole rope is literally iced to the bottom of the boat. And I'm talking like, oh my gosh, look at that, man. If you don't think it's cold out here, think again. It is absolutely freezing. How much power do we got left on there? 65%? Not bad, man. And I got both lights on. I also have the battery pack plugged in, charging my battery the whole time. We got a slick little setup here. Oh, something on there, dude. Hey, man, what is this, you guys? Check that out. That definitely looks like some kind of tool or something to me. That looks like a handle. Definitely looks like it's broke here. Who knows what that thing is, you guys? It's a metal taser. Bzz, bzz. Not too bad, you guys. We pretty much filled our cart just about to the top. I would love to stay out here and keep tossing, you guys, but it is two o'clock in the morning. I still got a ways to go down river just to get off the water. Then I gotta pack everything up. By the time I get home, the sun is just about gonna be coming up. All right, you guys, of course, I completely forgot to do my outro while I was out on the water. It was like three o'clock in the morning. It was absolutely freezing, and I was in a hurry to get the heck out of there. But you guys, Guys, very first night mission out on the boat, and I would say super successful. That big old 30,000 lumen work light worked amazing. My headlamp worked pretty good. We had just enough lighting where you could actually see what was going on. So there is no doubt we're definitely gonna be doing that in the future again for sure. We found tons of super cool stuff. We filled our cart right up to the top again, and again, you guys, we found another anchor. I've gotta have like 30 anchors by now. I don't even know they're all just sitting in a big pile but that is gonna wrap it up for our video here today you guys if you enjoyed this video please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me and don't forget to subscribe make sure to stay tuned and i will catch you on the next one